stop is gonna be Al Rauna and it's in uh, what is it called? Hi. Royal. Royal Plaza Mall. It's a mall, right? It's like a small mall in the Al Sad region. So we're gonna check out what they have for the FIFA. So this is 4.5 reals. What are those? Uh, mini banners for 7 reals. So this is the small plate and there's also a larger plate. This one is 17 and this one is 30. 33 Thir 23 23 oh, 23 yeah right. how much is this what? Ah, <laughs> 35 reals and this is for a candle it's so cute here you have the whole set and this is an even smaller plate you have these coffee cups so these flags, each of them is 1.5 reals. So these are not the official ones, but they look uh, similar in a way. So I think this is the price and it's only 16.5 reals, which is honestly, it's amazing for a ball, even though it's not the official, um, but still it's a nice like souvenir here. It's written Euro 2020, 2022, sorry. Guys, these flags are like a decent size and it's only 3 reals. It's honestly pretty good prices over here. So here you get like a pack of probably 10 or 15 flags for 30 reals. I'm guessing these are pillowcases, 28. Over here you have some cute glasses. 4.5 beanie for 8 rounds. Alright guys, so that was uh, stop number one. It was really successful. Honestly, I really enjoyed all the stuff they had in Rauna and i just dropped my mom off at home i'll do a haul at the end of this video of everything i got so second stop i'm gonna go to this like gas station and they have like a market called sidra at the gas station they have a few things related to the fifa so i'm gonna check these out and then i'm gonna continue to the third place Guys, as you saw at the Cedra, I only found a few things, but they are official products of FIFA. That's why they are pretty expensive. Um, I did not get anything because I don't need the football and etc. I'm not a tourist here. For those of you who don't know, I've lived here for more than 20 years, so um, I'm and I'm not like a huge football fan. But I'm doing this video for those of you who are. Those of you who want to take souvenirs with you home and gifts for your friends or whatever. So um, I left Sidra and I just got to the center. It's a, it's also like a small mall and called the center. And inside there's like a supermarket. Um, I forgot the name. I'll I'll film it later.
Alright guys, I left the center and I just got to Adidas outlet. Thing is, I saw at Adidas that they have like official clothing for Qatar's team and this is what I want to show you guys. It's um, it's a bit different from the other stuff we've seen, I guess. Oh, okay, so different texture, right? Yeah. Like this is better quality, obviously. So this one, 620, yeah. and this? 165. Okay. So change of plans, I ended up not going home because Adidas outlet barely had anything like there was just the official ball and the replica of the ball and um, I, sh I showed you some clothes of like Qatar with the Qatar flag but apparently this is not related to the FIFA at all I don't know, it's just like clothing for the Qatari football team I guess or just any random team but I'm headed to a place called NTS Sport. I heard they have a lot of FIFA stuff. Well, uh, I'll see you when I get there. This is 55 for else. And it comes with the short, you said. So quick haul, I got this plate from Rauna, so this plate was 12.5 reals. So I just got one just as like a souvenir of the FIFA, even though it does not like relate to the World Cup, it's just a football plate. I thought it's really like it's really good quality, it's really cute and it will be nice if I do like uh, if I cook something related to football, I don't know. And from the same shop, I also got this um, flag for my boyfriend. He's a huge Germany fan. So I did not get anything from Cedra, as I said. And then I went to the center, only got this notebook. We use a lot of notebooks to write down YouTube ideas or just like random to-do lists every day. This is a really cute one and the color is the color of the Qatari flag. Completely unrelated, but I also got rice noodles for dinner tonight and I saw a lot of Christmas um, candies. They always have Christmas candies at the center. Couldn't go without one like sugar cane. And this one is uh, by Skittles. So I'm so excited to see how it tastes. I did get some footage of the Christmas section, but this will be for a Christmas video. Last but not least, I don't know why I got the Qatari uniform. And this was from NTS Sport. The guy there was so nice. Basically, I only wanted the shirt, but they only sell them uh, together, the shirt with the shorts. And let me show you guys. I saw Germany, Spain, I think. Anyways, just go and ask for your team or just call them. So this is what it looks like. Apparently, this is like the new um, edition for this year. Are the shorts, which I don't know if I'm gonna use the shorts. I might give them to my brother. By the way, guys, NTS Sports is also available in Souk Wakif, but I went to the Azizia uh, branch. So if you end up going to the Azizia branch, don't forget to mention my name. And hopefully, if he remembers me, he might give you a discount. And before I close off this video, I just want to say there's this kiosk at Villaggio that you probably have seen from my last video video where I go to the VIP section in Village Mall. It's like an Adidas kiosk in, uh, and it's in front of the food court. I'll insert some footage right here because they also have a lot of official FIFA clothing and items. Like you can find a lot of stuff, but it's definitely more expensive than NTS Sport and from the rest of the places we saw. Guys, if you're coming to Qatar, check out my Qatar playlist. I'm just giving you information about the accommodation, transportation, anything you need to know here. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Bye.